around for a while. And so it's been a good day. It's been good to be with cousins and uncles and uh, to know that we are still part of the family. And of course, as a pastor, as the people that I've ministered to over the years, we've emphasized we're not only a family, but we're also a family of God. We reach out in God's uh, protection and God's blessings and God's direction and God's will. And so our safety as we travel from place to place. God places his hand upon us and guides us and keeps us safe when we look to him for that. I was going to um, give an evangelistic message for those members of the family that really haven't stood up and begun to live right. <laughs> well, I take too long. Hang out all night. The way we are, the way we look, we're members of the family. And we love each other. We've been together for this day. And uh, I know that, as for myself, that I'll go home much richer in memories and understanding as I've seen the rest of the family that they've developed. And as we have given of ourselves to be the, in unity, to the Haney family together. Now I'm going to ask that God continue to bless us. I also want to remember that we're not all here. We have, <clears throat> we have people that couldn't make it because of health reasons. We've had some that have business uh, occasions and couldn't be here. And so we're not complete. We're not the whole body. And it's hard to get any time to get a whole family together. So as we share the joy of being together with each other, let's remember those that couldn't be here with us. Some have died and are not with us. They're not in this, in this world. And they've gone on. And so we won't run a litany and, and hold them up, those that have passed on. We know that the ones that have, uh, that we can still in our own hearts remember them. But we remember that uh, we've come to Texas. And outside of learning Texas Brogue and understanding the language and finding the miles that go on and on, <laughs> and uh, can only be duplicated by going east and west in Kansas, that we find our state dialects begin to blend into that one language that is Haney language. And so uh, as we come to the time of uh, evaluation, the time of looking back and a time of saying, hey, we were in Texas for that Haney reunion. And it's a time I think we can hold on with which memories. I'm going to ask uh, the Lord to bless us as he has blessed us, to be with us as we separate from this place, to guide us and to strengthen us and to continue to draw us close, even though we may be apart by distance and miles. In the heart language and in the spirit language, we're still the Haney. Our Heavenly Father, we do thank you for the blessings of being together. We thank you the blessings of our young children that will continue to carry the line of the Haney blood and the Haney humor and the Haney stick to us. Lord, we thank you for each one of them. We ask that you continue to bless and guide them as they move through their mature years and find and establish their own families. We thank you for each family that has found each other as husbands and wives, that we have reached out and find the strength of, of being one in that individual family. But joining through the bloodlines and through the history and through the genealogy and the DNA, we're still the Haney family. Bless us, O oh God, in every way, and we will give you the praise and the glory, for we come in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Amen.